Hello. Welcome to the video. I'm Zara. Meow. Ah. <laughs> Meow. Fuck off. Fucking faggot. Fanny wankers. <laughs> Hi Tourette's. Welcome. I don't think I ever talk about working out activity, that sort of jazz in my YouTube videos much, but I post it quite a lot on my Instagram, on my stories, but working out is like a big part of my day to day. I love it. I love working out. I hate working specific muscle groups. Back and biceps day or like we're, we're gonna work hamstrings. I work out to perform well. I work out to get skills, to feel good. I'm trying to improve my relationship with my body because it's not great. I don't talk much about that side of things or body image or anything like that much anywhere online to be honest, but it has been a very, very big struggle for a large majority of my life, particularly the past year. It's not been great, <laughs> but we're trying. Speaking of trying, I'm gonna do a try on haul. I've got a Gymshark haul because they had a sale and I decided that I really wanted new things, so I splurged. Also, this is not sponsored. I wish it was. <clears throat> Gymshark, please. I just wanted to share some of the things I bought because I think they're a great brand and I like them. And also doing try-ons is fun, so. We're gonna unbox, unpackage, unbag. Things don't really come in boxes anymore, which I think is a good environment. Wait, that, no, that's not good environmentally. This is plastic. A box would be more environmentally friendly. Oh no. We're stripping off. Not like that, no. Who likes my pants today? I'm wearing blue slash kind of teal. My mum thinks the green, I beg to differ. I look kind of workwear chic today. We're looking a little bit fancier. First thing, these are the Adapt Animal seamless leggings. In black because I really need some plain gym wear because I have a couple of colorful pieces that look cool in a set, but you can't really mix and match them as easily. So I just need some plain leggings. I think I can also get away with wearing these just with a normal outfit because from afar it's like black. Yeah, she's plain. She's a little bit boring, but like in a classy way. But up close, you've got the cool pattern. There's a bit of pop, bit of interest. And they've got a nice stretchy waistband without it cutting into you. And obviously they're seamless. So hopefully we'll have no issues in the front, if you know what I mean. I've got a slight bum scrunch, which I'm not used to, but we'll see if it does us any justice. I think it'll look great with the other Animal Adapt tops because I do have a blue and a green one, so I'll see how they mix and match. Oh shit. This is a wild card. She's small, she's simple, she's basic. Emphasis on the small. I'm hoping this won't be see-through. As we all know, white is unforgiving. This, on the other hand, is quite thick. We'll give it a go. Hopefully this actually fits well enough to put on the internet without getting demonetized. I feel kind of naked. This might go back. I think the white plus the kind of minimal, to say the least, look is kind of too much. Could I get away with this in a gym? That's the question but it's really cute. It's got a really cool adjustable back, so you can actually wear it as a halter neck if you want, or you can adjust the back straps, you can cross them in any way you want. It's four little attachments at the back, so it's a really versatile, minimal sports bra. I don't know how much parents would approve of this one, but I like it, and I think it'll just match things nicely, so we're gonna try that on, and it's obviously a very light support one. <laughs> Number three some shorts. These are the Adapt Camo black shorts. I love the shorts so much, they're so comfy and stretchy. So I wanted them in black just as a basic pair to go along with other things. I think these will mix and match really well. They feel nice and soft and stretchy just the same, so they'll be good. These don't have a butt scrunch like the leggings, but I kind of like that because shorts are a little bit more on the risque side anyway, so having a bit more coverage in the back and a little less separation can actually be nice to just preserve your dignity a tiny bit. Number four, this is the Ruched Sports Bra in Rosewood Red. It has a little bit of mesh right at the back, crisscross straps, and then 
obviously the ruching in the front, which I think is super flattering, super pretty. And I love this colour. The reason I picked red, even though I never wear red apart from in gym wear, like you'll never see me in red every day, everyday clothing, but something about red gym wear just makes me feel powerful. I just like it. Again, I think it'll mix and match very nicely. It'll go with the shorts, it'll go with the leggings. We'll just have to pray that it fits. Another pair of leggings. These are the Adapt Camo Seamless Leggings in that Storm Red Cherry Brown colour. I'd also wear these with the red top because they pretty much match in shade. I think I'll get away with it. Again, these don't have the butt scrunch, but they're seamless in the front, so you don't have to worry about anything going on there. And they're really stretchy and comfy with a good, tight, supportive waistband without it digging in, which is why I love Gymshark. They're so expensive, they're a bit of a bougie brand, but since I've swapped over to Gymshark, I can't go back with my leggings and my shorts. Are you for real? I'm trying to film a video, dude. Now that I've swapped, I, I can't go back. I'm a person who has a very big hip to waist ratio, so anything that goes straight up and down does not sit on me nicely. I'm in between sizes, so something with as much stretch as this is really nice because it fits my hips and my thighs, but doesn't gape at the waist. But it also allows me to get the bigger size so that it's not too tight, but it still fits my waist. It's great. I just wanted to add in for a bit of realness because I feel like these shots don't do me justice. I want to keep my channel real. I don't want to become one of those people that are just putting really glorified posed images on. So here's a bit of realness. There's roles. Everybody is human. Everybody's different. Nobody has the perfect body, whatever that is. Please don't judge yourself based on what I'm putting on here. This is just me currently. This won't be me forever. This hasn't been me for a long time. Bodies change, people change, and everybody's different. So please take this as a positive and don't compare. <laughs> Easier said than done, I know, I've fallen into that trap before. Just wanted to shed a little bit of love and say, you are all perfect, no matter what size you are, no matter what your body looks like. This is just mine, mine isn't perfect. But we're here, we're enjoying it. Next, I've got the Adapt Animal teal sports bra in the butterfly print, and it's so pretty. I just love the green teal color, because it's like really bright, but isn't too in your face. I like it, I rate it. And also the style of these sports bras, I really like because they're so high neck and full coverage that you don't have to worry about anything. They're really high support, so they're perfect for me doing things like gymnastics or really hardcore hit workouts or running because you can jump up and down and not worry about anything. It's You just feel really well held in. This, this combo, this is my favorite. I also got the same animal collection high neck sports bra in the blue colour. This is the hybrid print, so meow, meow, meow. it's kind of like a mix. I really like this colour, it's a brighter blue. Meow. And again, same size, same fit, but I love it. I really want to get the shorts to match these. All the leggings, I can't decide. They only have cycling shorts and I'm not a cycling shorts fan. I prefer my short shorts so that I can hike them up and have them really high on my legs. Next, I've got the Adapt Camo shorts in the Storm Red Cherry Brown color. These are so comfy, so soft. They really hug you at the waist, just like the leggings do. I just find that they're really good if you have like a smaller waist, but then still kind of wider hips because it's really hard to get leggings and shorts that fit like that. But I find that these stretch so much that they just hug you really well. No camel toe, seamless at the front, perfect design. There's no butt scrunch on these, but I quite like that. <laughs> I kind of prefer it in a way. It draws less attention to your ass, which is really nice when you're in a gym full of older men and you're trying to avoid the stairs. I think these are pretty much my favorite thing that I've got so far. And to match that, I've got the sports bra from that collection, the camo seamless wrap over top, really really like it. It's really supportive and if you get the right size it doesn't cut 
into where it crosses over. I find that some crossover sports bras, it gives you like the full boob type problem, but this doesn't. It just really supports you. It's definitely a more high impact sports bra, which is great if you like running or if you do gymnastics like me. And the back has this really cool design that's the crossover. I think it just adds a really cool detail. Well, <laughs> fuck off, fuck it. Foo, wow. Do you like dick? Hmm, it's cool. <laughs> And again, the material is just really nice. You pay for the quality. That is probably why I love Gymshark, is for the quality, not for the price tags. <laughs> but all of these I got in the sale and I actually got this set on Vinted. I paid 30 pounds, including shipping, for the top and short set. I'm amazed, I'm so glad. Vinted is a great place to get stuff from if you can't afford the full price, but some of it's secondhand. This set and the two animal tank tops, they're all secondhand from Vinted, so I've saved a little bit. <laughs> but on that note, that is the end of my haul. I hope you enjoyed, hope it was interesting, and let me know if you want some more content like this. I want to do more workout videos because I literally have never done one. I've done one gymnastics video, but apart from that, I kind of keep this side, this whole plethora of my life away from YouTube. And I, I like that, I like a bit of privacy, but I also want to share this whole hobby with you guys. Maybe I'll have to just, you know, work up the courage, take my camera to the gym. Oh my god, that would be nerve wracking, but maybe. But yes, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next Sunday for another video. But for now, subscribe if you liked it, like the video if you liked it, and I hope you have a lovely day. Bye.